The overall goal of this method is to label antibodies with fluorescent dyes from purified samples or directly from cell medium using magnetic protein A or G beads. This method can be used to optimize the labeling chemistry of even small amount of antibodies within the cell medium, leading to better downstream application of the antibodies. The main advantages of this technique are that the antibodies do not require purification, amine or thiol chemistry can be used, and the method can be automated or manual. Begin by uniformly resuspending the beads with gentle shaking. Then add 50 microliters of beads to a 1.5 milliliter microcentrifuge tube and place the tube in a magnetic stand. After 10 seconds, carefully replace the storage buffer with 250 microliters of antibody binding buffer and mix the beads well. After another 10 seconds, carefully replace the binding buffer with 1 milliliter of the antibody of interest and mix the sample for 60 minutes at room temperature. At the end of the incubation, return the tubes to the magnet and remove the supernatant when the beads have moved to the side of the tube. Then rinse the beads and antibody mixture by two 10 second washes with 250 microliters of antibody binding wash buffer per wash. To label the antibodies using amine chemistry, after the second wash, replace the wash buffer with 100 microliters of amine conjugation buffer and add 2.5 microliters of freshly prepared amine reactive dye per one.